And we're back on the Red Dead Undead Frontier. I'd quickly like to file a formal complaint about the um, noises coming in from the next 10 over last night. And he's just doing charades. Alright, fine, I'll take care of it myself. Yeah, shut up. Ah, uh, that's much better. Now I'll be able to sleep soundly. Luckily this was all just a dream and we don't actually have to worry about her honor. I actually do want to save this little girl while we're waiting on Nigel. What the hell is that noise? Oh, those are gunshots. What the hell's going on? Guy holding up with a Gatling gun. Cool. Find an undead and bring it back to the doctor. Does it matter if it's dead or alive? I can, he's got plenty of bodies right here. This guy's obviously never played zombie in his lifetime or else he would have left one living while his friend goes to the bathroom. What an idiot. Well, maybe... Oh, no, that doesn't look too pleasant. Unless she's got a lot of fans. Yeah, she looks like she needs some help. Six zombies, six shots. Excuse me, sir. There we go. George's Gap is full of uh, a lot of customers. But there's no honor or money or, like, any sort of currency in this game. Why am I doing a good deed here to save this woman? Papa warned me, but I didn't listen. This is all my fault. Yeah, I agree. This is all your fault. I kissed a man and we weren't even betrothed. <gasps> you did what? Get off the horse. Get off the horse right now. This woman had a premarital kiss. Take her away, Zambies. Take her away. <laughs> Mighty gropey from time to time. Lord have mercy. Oh, there we go. They're getting her. Come on. Hit her again. It just gets worse. Die, witch. Die. Well, this guy's talking to his dead wife or something. That's disgusting. I just knew it. Here, foyer. You're peeping in on our love. Am I? What kind of love you making to a head, mister? Let's just put you out of your misery. This whole reason of the zombie apocalypse and our demise is on the back of my horse and I can't do anything about it. Good luck helping your family, Mr. Marston. Yeah, good luck uh, praising the devil, you premarital whore. Oh yes, I can finally go visit our buddy Nigel. So time to become an imposter. We're going to a camp full of army deserters, and we're going to get an outfit and uh, get a train ride to Mexico. Apparently they won't recruit me if I don't have any shoes on, which is stupid. That and my IQ. Feckin' imbeciles. I'll show them. Or steal it and suffer the consequences. Kind of want to steal it and see what kind of consequence I'd suffer. Are you boys okay? I'm here for the uniform. Name's Marston. Um, okay, I'm assuming it's right here. Oh yeah, I got the outfit on. Okay, you guys have a good one now. I'll look and smell the part too, because I haven't showered in weeks. Just roll. The zombies won't be able to get on the train. Just drive. Just drive off. The hell? That one's crawling at me. Oh my god, that guy's got an axe in his head. Is that uncle? Well, too late now. This is the whole army going to Mexico. There's only five of us. Say goodnight, freaks. Man, I'll never forgive Rockstar for not making a second one of these for Red Dead 2. You did real good, soldier. Thank you. Basic training was very thorough. Yeah, shoot any unarmed civilians. Can I push one of them off the train? Oh, looks like I can. All right. See ya, buddy. <laughs> Have fun. We'll be in Mexico. I'm emptying out our cargo. I'm trying to lighten the load. All right, come on. You're... There we go. There's only one other person on the train with me. I can't believe I can get away with this. This is so stupid. There we go. Now it's just me on the train. See ya, fellas. I don't know how to stop these things. That might be a problem. Ow! Ow! John! John, get up! Get up, you goddamn buffoon! What are you doing, John? Oh, God. Oh, okay. I thought for a second I definitely deserved that. It was coming right for me, officer, I swear. Oh, that's right. I already killed the rest of the marshals. Oh, what? They're back? In the cutscene? That's crap! No, you guys are on your own. This is obviously an ambush. I've done this in the past with my other gang. Come on! To pick up a crank, dumbass, before I toss you over the side again. Alright, yellow bellies, let me show you how it's done. Do I not have a bomb? Oh, I have a blunderbuss, that's right. Marshall, can you specifically leave this part out of the report? What the, re what? the rest of these buffoons are running. I already killed them all. We didn't need those idiots all along. I'm glad I threw them over the side. You know, that's the cannon ending, that I threw them over the side while we were on this bridge and they all died. Oh, and another roadblock. Hopefully it's not full of dynamite. Oh god, break. I said break, not brace. Oh, what? How did my horse get on the other side? You know what? No matter. Come here, horsey. You know what? I think the marshal was right. There are a lot less zombies, if any at all. I don't see any. A mythical creature appeared in the area. <gasps> That's another horse. It better be another freak of nature like the other freak of nature that I missed dearly. Ow! I'm okay. Freak, are you okay? Freak? Oh, God, talk to me, freak. No! Freak!
Come here, dumbass. That's what I'll name you, dumbass. Oh, that's a feckin' cougar! No, please, please don't drag me! No, 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 no! Oh! Come on, I promise I'll take better care of you than the last one. Yes! Okay, that's all I needed to tell him. He's a f famine horse. No, thanks. I'd like one that's fed properly. What's so special about this guy anyways? He's not nearly as cool as the other freak in nature. I don't even want to know what that is on his ass. I don't- I really don't want to know. We're at, uh, Los Pollos Hermanos. Oh, it's a cute little couple at the train station. I don't think the trains are coming, guys. I'm sorry, is that a woman? Did a woman of the cloth just shoot that unarmed man? Please, you have to help them. You help them. All right, come here, dumbass. We got a church full of nuns to save. I don't know why I'm sitting in cover. Ow, oh, okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. Now, there's another sister of the cloth here. Get your hands off me, sister. You're no woman of the cloth. Stop pushing her. Get your gun out. Ow, stop that. Fucking, I don't have any McDonald's queso. Is that a woman in the cloth with a rifle in her hands? No, put that down. God damn it. Now the, now the survivors are shooting me. Oh, come on. I made one mistake. I like how I could still save the town after shooting all the survivors. That makes no sense. The town is... Oh, wait, hold on. The town is saved. There we go. I think I shot more nuns than any of them. Yeah, there's no one here. Who was I meant to save? I think I got scammed. All your supplies are on fire too, by the way, idiots. Can you stop? Who did that? Come down. Come down. Motherfucker. Alright, let me tell that uh, nun that I saved all her sisters, even though I killed probably like half of them in the process. And most of them weren't even zombies. It's Mother Superior. Ah, I see. You, you, you shoot one zombie and you're Mother Superior. I want to work with a subject who has only recently turned. What the hell, are you gonna read a few Bible verses? What are you gonna do? I just wanted to warm things up over here a little bit. Now I'll be on my way, my ladies. Come back here. Should we put out some of these fires? I don't feel very comfortable with my building on fire. Yeah, there's smoke coming in through the floorboards. I don't feel very comfortable sleeping here. I mean, the nuns are still refusing to speak to me for some weird reason. I don't know why. Sure, yeah, yeah, I'll help you, sir. You're not looking so hot, sir. Ew, gross. You know what, sir? I got just a thing for that little thing. Oh, no! I got him. He's coming right for me. Brother Superior, I think I have a test case for you. You're a true pilgrim. That I ain't. Yeah, actually, I'm a cowboy, idiot. Here. What is that? Is that acid? Why are you burning him alive? Might as well eradicate this graveyard full of the undead. Oh, hold on. Easy there, fellas. I'm burning one last coffin. Thanks, buddies. Ouch! Jesus. Is that queso or is that the Hulk? I'm getting out of here. No, don't search the corpse, dumbass! I'm out of here. I got some ribs. Cool. Oh, there we go. Oh, it's uh, Captain DeSanta. I remember this guy from the story mode. Probably the most normal graveyard zombie boss we've gotten. Armadillo is now under attack by the undead hordes. Okay. Well, I'm all the way down in a completely different country, so if you guys could handle it yourselves. I thought it was crazy, and I actually had to turn up my volume because I kept hearing these flies surrounding me, like, all the time. I thought it was a glitch, but it's actually my horse. So I decided instead of dumbass, we'll just call him Stinky or Smelly instead. Is that a hooker zombie what because she's still in character somehow even this guy is what the hell do you think i like shooting women you filthy whoremongering wretch yeah they don't suck they bite dumbass so how have you been well i joined the army and a Immediately deserted. I can just sleep with the door wide open. All right, feck it. <laughs> There's a zombie in the room with me. He almost ran me over. Unless you bring him some undead bait and dynamite. I do have some undead bait. Yeah, I have three. What the hell? I guess I need some dynamite too. Where the hell am I supposed to get dynamite at? Oh, Ridgewood Farm is under attack. I can't be ten places at once. Somebody's got to defend themselves. I've injured a survivor? Why was he standing in the middle of the street then? What an idiot. No, oh God, three women on all fours after me. Is this what my grandma meant when she said there would be all sorts of young ladies after me? Ow! Stay back, furries. I just assume that's why they're on all fours. Is because they're furries? I don't know. I don't care who you are. You're getting offed. That one's riding a horse. Oh, no, I think it was a survivor, too, again. God damn it. And I got him lit on fire. Oh, Jesus Christ. Is this woman a zombie? No, it can't be. See, real-life alive women usually run the opposite direction of me. The zombie women, though, run my direction. There we go. Are they all dead? I think they're all dead. Did I save the town? I think I saved the town. Please don't make me restart that entire process. It's gonna make me... It's gonna make me restart the entire process. What the hell? 
I killed them all. You know what? You guys are on your own. Feck all of you guys. I'm out of here. With that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you are new, consider subscribing. And in the meantime, check out this video right here, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.